Hello, it's Ben R from 3 Techno. Today I'm going to show you how to install Linux on your Chromebook. To let you guys know, this will wipe all data on your Chromebook, so be sure to make sure all that is uploaded to Google Drive or you do not need it. In the description of this video, I will also include a link to the blog post in which I put this under so you can view step by step instructions of what we do in this video. To do this, all you're going to need is a stable Wi-Fi connection. Start out by closing any windows that you may have open. The first step is you need to put your device into developer mode. To do this, hold escape, refresh, and power. The screen will go blank for a second, then this should pop up. Although it says Chrome OS is missing or damaged, that is not true. This is the first step into putting your device into developer mode. Now, you're going to want to click Control and D, and then this screen will pop up. You want to turn OS verification off, so you're going to want to press Enter. Then your screen is going to go black. It's going to reboot. Keep it at this screen. It will beep in a few seconds. Then it will be a 15-minute process to put your device into developer mode. After that, your device should say that it is preparing system for developer mode. This will take a while. After this screen, there will be an about 10 to 15 minute process of it putting your device into developer mode. After that, you will see the screen that you first had when you opened your Chromebook, the welcome screen. Enter your Wi-Fi password and log in. This is the sign of your device rebooting. This will take longer. You can do Control D for a shortcut. Now it is rebooting. At this point, log in with your information. Now you should have your desktop and it should look like normal. Now in Chrome you need to download Linux. It is a small file. Place this link into your browser. It will be available in the description of the video. Now search for this and it will download a file called Crouton. Now, the next step you can do without any windows open or you can do it with Chrome open. What you want to do is click Control, Alt, and T. And it should open this window in Chrome. First command you want to run is shut. So run that. Then this should pop up. This is the next command you're going to want to run and crash. Now you want to type in that command. I will have it listed in the description. I'm going to type it in. And for this download, make sure you do a capital D. Now that you've typed that command in, you want to run it. Now it's going to start running a long process. I will come back when it's done. You can grab a, a cup of coffee because this will take a while. You will know it is done when it says please specify is a username for the primary user. You need to make new password. First, read these tips that it gives you. You flip between your desktops by hitting Control alt shift back and Control alt shift forward Run this final command called sudo space start x f c e 4. Run that. Now you will be in Linux. It says welcome to the final start. It says welcome to the first start of the panel. 
click use default config. And now you have Linux installed on your computer. This was Ben R from 3techno.com. Stay tuned for, mo for more posts, reviews, and app tutorials.